Hey everybody, what's going on? Thanks for checking out this video. Today, I'll be going over my Carhartt seat saver um, seat covers for my truck. I've had them for about, I don't know, seven or eight months now. So this is just gonna be an honest review. No ad, no sponsorship. This is just me gonna talk about the seat covers, let you know what I think, if I like them, if I don't. So y'all stay tuned. Okay, so I'm gonna start off in the front seat in the driver's seat. So I have a I have a gray F-150 and it's got the cloth cloth seats. Here's the color of my cloth. So that's that's my cloth color. So I got the gray Carhartt seat saver seat covers. So if you can see it right there, that's just the original seat saver. But they're uh I'm not sure the exact color. I mean I know it's it's a gray so i've had them for about seven or eight months now you can see them and they fit they look good i mean i don't have them as tight as they could be i mean they're kind of it's kind of messed up on the back from where i've been sitting on them but it's uh i mean you can see there are there's a couple of stains that are on there i think i think that's from ice cream or something but um it's better to be on these than the actual cloth seats itself because these you can actually take out you can take them out and throw them in the washer and clean them. But you can see, like, right here, it stops. It's stitched together. That way, stuff doesn't get mashed into your seats. Like, it's all stitched together. It's one big piece. So, no, no crumbs, no dirt can get down in there. Um, I like them. And you can't even... There's not even... Not any wear and tear on them. This... There's one rough spot right here. I'm not exactly sure what it's from. It could be from me sliding in and out with a bell tone. I'm not exactly sure. But I mean, it's it's not uh, messed up. It's just miscolored right here. So that's that's the front seat on the driver's side. And then the back seat is the same color. These, I never even use them that much. Usually I have my truck like this, um, but you can see how they, how they strap on they you just hook them and buckle them up under up under the seat you can tighten them loosen them however you need and it's still you still have room for your pull tab to let the seats up and down you know you've got your your slit for your seat belt and these back here are a lot tighter i got these a whole lot tighter than i did in the front i mean these almost look like from their like they're from the factory back here but the main reason I bought these, I was looking for some seat covers when I got the truck, and I saw a video on YouTube of a guy that had a chainsaw sitting back here in the back seat, and he left it overnight, and it leaked. I mean, if you're around a chainsaw, you know it's going to leak oil, gas, something's going to happen. It leaked. Oil or gas, I'm not exactly sure, but it was all in this seat, and I was like, there's no way. I said, this is ridiculous. That guy's seats are ruined. He pulled the seat covers off, and there was no stain, no anything. It ate, it absorbed all that oil and grease that it had leaked out and it did not bleed through and i don't have a water bottle with me but these seats what liquids bead up on it so if you spill a whole bottle of water it just beads up and it would run in the floor so on that note they're they're very durable they hold up you can see uh i've got the 60 40 bench seat back here so honestly i like them they're expensive if I had to do it again and I was getting another new truck, I would definitely, definitely buy some more. This is how it's set up in the back. It's got your strap. It depends on the console you have. Most trucks don't have this console like I've got in my truck. This is the only thing I honestly don't like about it. This right here, I have the, I have the bench seat up here in the front. So this, this slides up, you know, I'm not going to pull it all the way because my change will fall out. But this right here slides up, you know, my armrest. And I don't have a problem with that, but this right here, it just doesn't look that clean. Like it doesn't look right. And this right here is, is never stays down. Like I try to, I try to do like this, but it, it just comes back up. That's my only complaint with these seat covers. And the fact that they're a pain in the butt to try to put on. That um, up there in the armrest, and being a pain to put on is my only complaints. But I mean, you can see, you know, they, it covers the headrest in the front, headrest in the back, everything. Here's a look at the passenger seat. You know, it's set up the same way. And when you buy these, there's actually a right and a wrong way to put them on. I did not know that. So I'm not exactly sure if I have them on the right way because I don't know how to tell you which way to put them on. But I watched a video afterwards and the guy was saying something about 
it says it on the tag on the inside so you'll have to look for that but my my honest review is i think they're worth it i know they're expensive but if you're gonna have a truck or a car for a long time i would definitely recommend them i've i mean obviously you can see i've got some stains on here and it's better to stain something like this you can take them out and wash it than the actual cloth seats themselves so i appreciate y'all watching this video and definitely if you're thinking about getting them i give them a thumbs up so y'all should probably go ahead and buy them it's definitely a good investment for your vehicle